Beardsley Reservoir is in the Summit Ranger District of the Stanislaus National Forest. Developed recreational facilities are available, and the reservoir is popular for camping, day use, and fishing. The reservoir is open all year long, with road access generally open even in the winter, depending on the weather. On this day we're visiting Beardsley, the water surface elevation was 3,368 feet above sea level, and the reservoir had in storage 78,226 acre feet of water. In a moment, we'll be looking at the outflow from the hydropower plant, which was flowing at 150 cubic feet per second. This is an interesting video that was produced after the completion of the dam, and you can find it on YouTube. We'll put a link below. For many years, the only incursion into this forested wilderness was the sound of falling trees and the steam engines from the Pickering Lumber Company in Standard, California. Much effort went into building the logging railroads, including this section pictured, which required blasting a route across a solid granite canyon face. We'll see a modern view of this route in just a bit. Beardsley flat as it appeared before construction of the dam in 1955. If you enjoy history, you'll want to click on the links below and look at the extensive filmed historical record of the construction of this dam. We're looking at the powerhouse as it's going up, and we'll come back to this area with a look at the powerhouse as it appears today. Two things I find remarkable about Beardsley Dam and Reservoir are first that it only took two years to build the dam. They started in 1955 and finished in 57. Second thing I find remarkable is that it was built with no state or federal funding. Beardsley provides irrigation water for farmers in the valley, and back in the 1950s, the irrigation districts paid for the construction. With the rising lake waters, it was known that Beardsley Flat would be flooded and this would flood the railroad grade. So a new route for the railroad was made across the dam. In the 1950s, they went through quite a bit of effort to allow the logging railroad to continue to operate. 
And yet, ten years later, the last whistles of the little old steam trains were silenced as the industry moved to utilizing logging trucks instead of rails. And today, the former railroad grade is a paved road which we will use to cross the dam. The area around Beardsley Reservoir and Dam is filled with forest roads and wonderful opportunities for off-road exploring. Most of these don't require any specially built-up four-wheel drive rig, but if you do enjoy driving out in the woods and exploring new areas, the vicinity around Beardsley offers a lot of opportunities. Now in mid-spring when we were visiting, most of these roads were still gated off due to winter closures, but we did find one path here to explore. If you're interested in off-roading experiences, be sure to check with the Summit Ranger District of the Stanislaus National Forest for current conditions and permissible off-road uses. There is a link below to their website. Hey everybody, this is Ariel the Jeep Dog. Thanks for watching our video, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button down there.